This episode of The Modern Rogue brought to you by NordVPN. Head on over to nordvpn.com slash rogue, spell it right, R-O-G-U-E, use promo code rogue at checkout, get a sweet deal on two years and an extra month free. You're welcome. What is NordVPN? Nobody knows, unless you stick around to the end of the video. How long has it been? Half a decade? Nearly 400 episodes? I grew out my hair for this moment. I'm wearing my rattiest hoodie, the one that my dog bit a hole through. Okay. I have been growing out my beard so I could be at Prime Hobo. You're almost ready for the lifestyle. Sun in your face, wind in your hair. I don't speak the language. We're gonna figure that out. All right, dude. We have talked about Hobo Code like before we even had a show. Yeah. We were like, we should do a thing that leads hundreds of episodes up to a moment where we learn Hobo Code. Uh, who uses Hobo Code? Nobody alive. There are actually a few. No. Uh, hobos are actually a proud tradition dating back to like maybe the 19th century. And it's a lifestyle that uh, a lot of people chose out of necessity in the Great Depression when the economy totally collapsed. It sucked. I don't know if you've heard about it. Uh, uh, no, I uh, heard it was great. Uh, well, okay. <laughs> it's a oh, it's nailed you it. You got there. No, no. I gotta give you that one. That was good. Yeah, back in the Great Depression, a lot of people couldn't find work, so they started riding the rails, just traveling from town to town, finding menial work for their survival. And they developed a code. It became kind of a community, and then people started just doing it by choice. Pre-internet, pre-BBSs, pre-white uh, pages, pre-any of that stuff, I think the last vestige of it there was some symbol that people were using to indicate Wi-Fi is here. Oh. Do you remember seeing <laughs> yeah. that in the wild? Yeah. That's right. That's yeah. the closest I think I've, I've seen. But in that time where there was a, a secret society, a world beneath the world of whispers and, and like, this person's cool, this person's not. God, how magical must that have felt to be a spirit among them? Yeah, and they were able to keep it together because there are actual hobo conventions every year in Iowa 20,000 people show up. I don't believe you. 20,000 people, we're going. No, it's gotta be a Hoboken. That's where, it... no? God. You been hanging out with Corey too much? I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm the mayo dad. Mayo dad. All right guys, I don't wanna have to punish you. Yeah. <laughs> there it is. In like 1889, the committee of hobos, they even set up a code of ethics. D d does any vestige of this still exist? Like, could we become like card-carrying hobos? Well, uh, yes, uh, actually we can. At this festival where 20,000 people show up, there are actual people who still have the lifestyle of riding the rails and finding work where they can. Total freedom. Quick question. What do you think the overlap is between this and SantaCon? <laughs> <laughs> Big. Okay, I mean, all, right, all right. Both of them cover a lot of ground. Yes, yeah, yeah, okay. Beards. Yep. Okay, so if we're gonna learn Hobo Code existed essentially as an invisible language so that you could travel freely. Yeah, it would tell you things like where you could uh, find work, where you could find food, watch out for this dog, hey, the cops around here, jerks. All sorts of things were communicated. Right, hit, written. Hit, hit me, hit me. Oh, okay. uh, yeah, yeah, let's jump. To the board. Oh, there we go. All right, where do we start? Okay. We'll start off simple. What do you think this indicates? Victory. This one is the symbol for a woman. Oh, wait, like a woman lives here? Yeah. Oh, oh, you would want to know that. I didn't even think about that. Like if, if you're going to approach in an extroverted way a household, you want to know what you're dealing with. Yeah, because a lot of these were grifts. You were often I running calls. I thought hobos were cool. What about grifting is not cool? I'm sorry. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> I'm sorry, scam no, school. No, that's fine, that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> this one uh, is uh, also something I think is pretty easy. A magician lives here. <laughs> <laughs> that's where you draw the rabbit. Uh, this one is a gentleman. Okay, wait, why would you not just put a man? That's a good question. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't know if these are if there's a different one for man, these are loosely codified. So yeah. you'll find variations where in some areas, I mean, this means woman, in some areas, this means firefighter. I think it can be really regional, but here's where it gets weird. Oh, here's where it gets weird. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah. Oh no. Yeah, I take the chalk. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Okay. No, yeah. no, that's not it. Okay. <laughs> that's, that's what it is. <laughs> it's like it's a, the harbinger of, of, of internet to come. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that one means dog. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. Maybe like uh, what is like it's bouncing or it I has, have it no has... idea. Well, here's another one that's similar. Poor man. Uh, actually, that tracks. If this is dog, ain't no money here. Right? Might as well be a dog. <laughs> Could be. Yeah. But also, you're warning people about dogs that might bite you. Oh, so it's that's like, interesting. Hey, be careful before you approach this house for work or food or whatever. I'm loving this. Keep going. Oh, talk about how you love God. Talk about religion, get food. Yeah! It's kind of like a lock-in <laughs> at like a Baptist church when you're a kid and you go and you're like, pizza, pizza. And they're like, hang on, we got to talk about Jesus first. I want to say there was a study that said like in all email correspondence, there are various words that were associated with what turned out to be scams and God was number one you at the list. Say. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this one's pretty helpful. means there are X-Men nearby. Watch out for Wolverine. I, 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 I wish. <laughs> Please. Uh, this one, any guesses? I would say danger. No, go uh, away. This one means this place is good for a handout. What? Oh, this is literally, you know what this is? This is literally a mark. This is a, oh. that word when we think of a person as mm -hmm. a mark, as I understand it, I've never actually tried this in real life. Yeah. But the idea was that somebody would have chalk on their fingertips at the carnival as they would go around. They would see somebody, as they said in the time, flashing cabbage, mm -hmm. having uh, money. And then they would go up and they would, they would, forgive me, mm -hmm. uh, they, would, they would pat them on the back and now Everybody knew you're a mark. I never knew that. Really? That's super cool. Oh, look at this. We're both learning. That's super cool. <laughs> uh, speaking of, this one's a little strange. And uh, I did that incorrectly. Um, I, <laughs> I mean, come on. <laughs> You can't draw it. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't do it. I can't, it's just. <laughs> this means easy mark. I believe you. <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> okay. <laughs> here, here's, an, here's an interesting one that okay. might. So we got, now this is interesting. I think I see the roots of this one. Oh, DNA is real. Uh, yeah. Crick and Watson live here in this yeah, house. Exactly. Actually, technically RNA. Oh uh, yeah, that's true, that's true. Ahead of yep. you. This is a uh, help if you're sick. Oh, this, uh, uh, the uh, uh, yeah, similar to the uh, the um, snakes and the yeah. uh, whatever the, uh, uh, there's another word for it, I don't know it. It's, somebody put it on the screen. So I'm gonna assume there's not like a perfect alphabet of exactly this many uh, hobo code. I got to imagine yeah. that there as many as ideas out there. Oh yeah, so the thing to do is to go out and see what we can find in the wild. Man, if only we had somebody like Corey Cranfield who would go out into the wild of our backyard and actually set up these codes. Let's go be hobos. <laughs> oh, hang on. <laughs> Hello, good sir. Hey, brushy. Hello, hobo. Wait, are secret hobo names a thing? I think we need secret hobo names. Mine will be Brian. Mine will be Murphy. Great. Sir Murphy. Uh, this is uh, Brian. It appears as though we found a new location for our adventures. The land of plenty. Yeah. The land of enough. The land of mediocrity. <laughs> Wait, hold, behold. Ah. What is this? Okay. Okay, hold on. Um, do you already know this one? Is it a, is it, no, is it? It, uh, it looks like a wine glass with something dumped out. Just thinking or... a football goal post with, uh, I don't. Before you check. I'm gonna guess this is an indication of how many people live in the house and what, uh, oh. uh, three adults, two children. Oh, okay. Do you want me to check? Yes. I have no idea. Yeah, these are two separate things. This one is good chance to get money here. 
Wait, good we chance to get money here. Uh, uh, okay, first of all, that's a lie. <laughs> and this just means here is the place. I already know I'm here. Like, actually, hold on. That's not bad. This is like a hello world. This right. is the beginning. Like, hey, pay attention, dummy. There is hobo code forward. Yes. Okay. That's a good point. Cool. Uh, that's right. probably yeah, what they no, use. That's not bad at all. Oh, also, here is the place that you've been hearing about to make money. Oh, of course. Oh, wait, that's this is money. They're coins. I didn't realize that I until just now. <laughs> 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 We're great hobos. <laughs> This one is harder to read for me because it could mean anything. This looks bad, but I'm gonna bet that it's not bad. I'm gonna oh. bet that it's here as a message of something good is around. Oh, it's real good. I yeah. know what this one is. What? Anything goes. Wait, really? <laughs> yeah. Uh, open season, basically? Open se I, yeah, who knows what that means? Oh, damn. <laughs> Look, ho, oh, in the distance. Oh, she Symbols. Religious people live here, do a lot of God talk. And get some pizza. No, the M, what does the M mean? The M, I don't know. I would guess that pointy edges in general are more of a warning. I'm making this up. From the dog one, pointy edges seem to be like, you know, like teeth, like a warning. Sure. Whereas smooth stuff, it was like easy money yeah. and so on. So I, I'm gonna bet this is somehow bad. It could mean Twin Peaks, might not be an M. I'm gonna say whatever it is, it's probably not good. Let's see. Tell a hard luck story here. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, that makes sense. So sort of, uh, you know, all the travels, how difficult oh, it was to get here. Downs. Exactly, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, I'm believing that. And so if they feel sorry for you, Maybe they'll hook you up with some food. All right, hold on. I'm already do, seeing some other stuff. Yes, I do. Not only do I see something, but it's something that I believe we've already oh. learned about. <laughs> this is easy money, right? No, that one, remember, is a poor person. Like a poor man, right? The squiggly line like that means poor man, but this one means good for a handout. So a generous poor person, I suppose? Okay. They'll hook you up, they'll help you with some food, maybe. Whoa. They maybe don't expect money, but. All right, so. Not a dog, but a cool, cool bro. Yeah. I'm gonna keep saying this kind of thing and eventually I have to be right, but this looks like an adult with three kids. I think you're right. The four bars though, it looks like a, a musical bar or something like that. I don't know anything about music. Yeah, show up, play some jazz. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, just do music, it's fine. Yeah. This one means, oh, kind woman. Okay. And Housewife will feed you for chores. Sorry, hold on, hold on. Just kind woman, th these are not kids? Or? Same, well, same symbol. I think that might be indicating that the kind woman does have some kids, but okay. that just means kind woman. One more time. She's a housewife and she will give you food for chores. How do you suppose that happens? Well, you show up and you knock on the door. She's probably baking something in no, the kiln. I, I, no, I mean the four lines. I'm, oh. I'm trying to read mm. into the why. Yeah, I don't know. That one just seems kind of random. I can't really. Okay, well, the previous one was what? An easy oh, mark? Well, anything goes. A anything goes, okay, yeah. okay. So in this case, it's just like, maybe this one is horizontal to represent, um, I'm making this up. Keep on the straight and narrow. Unlike anything goes. I like it, yeah. yeah. Oh, I see one. Oh, uh, uh, the thing that looks like a shark waters obviously means dog. Yeah. Uh, but this other one, huh? <laughs> like they have multiple gaming cars. consoles. I was going to say three <laughs> car garage. Xbox, PS3, and uh, Nintendo. There it is. Uh, uh, that's sad. Yeah, I don't know. Huh? I mean, it was a long time ago. There was only they were only up to three. Oh, they only had the PS3 in the Great yeah, Depression? Yeah. No wonder they were depressed. I mean, it was, I'm gonna guess that we know this is a dangerous place to sneak up on. Yep. Yes. I'm gonna guess this is some kind of indication of security or of it being well fortified, like like you're yeah. not gonna be able to break your way in okay. or something. I like that. I'm I, making that up. Yeah, no, that's I like that one. Oh, this is actually just emphasizing, hey, dog. Right? Bad dog. Like, is he fenced? I don't know. Uh, 
somehow being outside, the dog one, these look like teeth more to me now. Okay, sure. Um, bite yeah. and jail. So it's like, <laughs> don't don't mess around over here is, right. is what I'm perceiving. Yeah, I like that. Okay, um, so let's leave here and yeah, let's keep go. going. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, did you it, see something? It, smiley face. Oh, hey. There's no way this really is just a smiley face, right? Ah, <laughs> uh, I doubt it. I'm just gonna guess that it would mean like, hey, all is good here. You got friends here. Ah, that's our, we already Too have easy? the it, anything goes hashes. Yeah, I, I don't have anything better. What is it? What do we got? What do we got? <laughs> Can sleep in barn. Of course. <laughs> Maybe that very obvious. Means our shelter. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Cool. All right. Right uh, on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. I don't want to say what those look like, but wait. Oh my God. Now I'm kicking in my, yeah. my Corey thinking brain. Oh, okay. 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 So okay. first of all, we have the same, you know, Jesus people live here. But what we have, I believe, are two graves. I believe those are shovels that are Whoa. indicating Whoa. that this is where people have died. I like it. This seems to me like a thing that Corey would do. It does. Yeah, those are clearly two shovels, right? Uh, Don't tell me what I you might think they say. are. <laughs> we'll go yeah. with shovels. You know what? Keep it family friendly. They're shovels. They're definitely shovels. Okay. I think that's right. Yeah, work available, actually, is what that means. No, that's not. I thought they were grave sites. I wish they I, were. I go. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I guess that tracks. Little, little disappointed, not gonna lie. I'm sorry. That's all right. <laughs> I am too, honestly. Uh, there's gotta be something at the bus, at the right? The bus, yeah. Yeah. Up, 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 up. There we go. Huh. Yeah. I mean. Okay, so. Is it canted for a reason? That's my question, is, is it just a circle or is it a circle? I don't know. Uh, Nothing here? Well. Like a zero? So we had the two hashes. That meant anything goes. Those are roughly kind of in the same area, but they're a closed loop. I like the nothing here. Oh, I know what it is. Do, it do means, you? Yeah. It means free smoke machine that smells like butthole. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> okay. Did I just I'm, spray I'm butthole not, everywhere not, again? No, no, no. Yes. Dude, it's awful. <laughs> oh, butthole, butthole, butthole. Oh. <laughs> Oh! I think you're right. I think it does, oh, it does do mean it does. nothing no here. Nothing doing here. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Right on. Okay, cool. Wow, man. Oh, and free rebar. I didn't know. I love free rebar. Man, it gets hot being a hobo. Yeah. <laughs> I did. There's got to be something at the train. There's got to be. I'm certain of it. Huh. No, 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 no. Oh, here we go. More rebar. More free rebar? Yes, it's yeah. everywhere. It's raining rebar. Love it. Here we go. Oh, geez. Aliens. That's my, <laughs> yep, yep. That means Shrek is a great movie. Uh, <laughs> I'm it, no longer a hobo. This is, somebody once told me the world is going to roll me. <laughs> no, everyone knows the symbol for that is this. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Shape of the mouth. There's no interpreting this one. This one means man with a gun. Oh, geez. <laughs> yeah. You know what? This does make sense in kind of a primitive, if you want to intimidate a bear, you do this to look big, which, uh, yeah, no, that, 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 that seems vaguely. Also, normally a triangle is man. Okay. But with, you know, like coming at you. Antennas. Uh, oh, with coming, antennas. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And a donkey. Uh, I thought it was <laughs> and a because, sassy attitude and like, a Scottish accent. <laughs> <laughs> donkey! All right, how many more we got? Uh, I think we've got just a couple more. All right, where are we going? Uh, Lead let's the go way. This way. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. What? There's Remus. a lot of stuff on that you, shed. Man. <laughs> you just told me this. A gentleman. I've already forgotten this one because I just. All I can think of are the things that it aren't. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> See, this one is problematic. <laughs> this one's canceled. Yeah. <laughs> A gentleman, what, what was it? Uh, easy Mark. Okay, yeah, <laughs> accurate. Also, uh, hold on. So I'm gonna say, if that other one was somebody armed, a man who is armed, I'm gonna say this is a man 
who brings gifts. It's a gentleman who's an easy mark who wants to give you something. This one is gentleman. Yes. Easy mark. Yes. Wealthy. And he wants to give you something. <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of wild how there's an internal logic to everything. You still think we're cut out for hobos? For the lifestyle? Uh, no. I suddenly realized, like, it got too warm just over the last 10 minutes. <laughs> I had this change. I, I, I don't care for it. The lifestyle is a lie. Like, There's oh, no yeah, nobility outside. on the silver rails. And plus, you have to do work. No. No. Well, I think I would like to put it to the community so that we can develop a modern rogue code. Rogue code. Right? So let us know down good. in the chat. I know yeah. you can't show us the symbols, but uh, post below and we'll, we'll start building a uh, rogue code. We'll start with 10, just 10 symbols that mean 10 roguish things, whatever that means to you, that you would like to see in the wild. And we'll begin, we'll grow the vocabulary from there. I love it. I Brilliant. love it. Brilliant. Okay, this place is air conditioned, so I'm gonna go inside there. I'll get some chalk and some more free rebar. Hey, John. Brian. You ever go to the bathroom? I have. When you go to the bathroom, are you committing crimes? That shouldn't really be any uh, of your business. Oh, you're saying I should respect your privacy? Yes. Ah, that's what it's like being on the internet. Because even if they don't know what you're doing, they know where you're going. That's the way it is on the internet. Everybody knows you're on some public Wi-Fi. They don't know what you're up to at bankofamerica.com, but they know where you are and they suspect you're banking. You ever wish you could just lock that door? I lock it every time. Oh, how, how, how do you do that? With the NordVPN. Oh my God. Are you saying that you can make it so that your IT manager doesn't know where you're going? That anybody on the public Wi-Fi doesn't know where you're going or what you're up to? And it's not saying that you're doing anything bad. It's just saying that you have the courtesy to lock the door while you're in the bathroom? Is there an echo? Because I thought I just said that. Yeah, no, if I'm hearing you correctly, it sounds like you can go to nordvpn.com slash rogue, that's R-O-G-U-E, support this very show, get a sweet deal on two years subscription plus an extra month free. I don't know if you said that part. Was that me or was that you? I don't remember anymore. Okay, but the important part is we all... <laughs> <laughs> but the important part is everybody should respect their own privacy by going to nordvpn.com slash rogue and support the show, right? Agreed. Okay. But you know that with the same account, you can use up to six different devices like your mobiles, your tablets, your laptops. Rest in peace. I'm sorry, my, my laptop died. My Kindle? You're probably. My phone? Probably. My computer? I, out of my range at this point, but I'm gonna assume a lot of devices. They don't track or collect any of your information. They have a no log privacy. Not that you're doing anything wrong, John. You're just in the bathroom and you want your privacy. I'm a very suspicious person by nature. Make me feel better. I've gotten that feeling about you. Guess what? Free 30 day risk free trial. Just try it out. Try locking the door and not Pooping where everyone can see. It's, I, 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 I went back to poop. It I was going to feel poop. better, but yeah. then. <laughs> <laughs> Offer and link in the description below. <laughs> a gentleman who's an easy mark and wants to sell you a Windows operated machine. This is Corey's office. <laughs> of course it is. It's a Microsoft Surface. 